This video will demonstrate how to erase and pair the 725 TRX transceivers. To erase the 725 TRX is very simple. First, find the pair button located at the top of the module, which is here. When you hold this button, the LED below will illuminate, then flash. Continue to hold this until the LED double flashes. This should take approximately 15 seconds. Now the LED is double flashing, you can release the button which will erase the unit, returning it to factory settings. When the product has successfully erased, the red and green LEDs here and here will flash alternatively. Now I'm going to repeat these steps to erase my other unit for pairing. Now both modules are erased and in factory default mode, I'm going to pair my transmitter to my receiver. To do this, I need to pair the input closed contact switch on our transmitter to the output relay on our receiver module. On our transmitter, you will see two LEDs located here. These show us the status of the input on our transmitter and the status of the acknowledged output on our receiver. In this demonstration, I've wired this switch to operate the input. Our first step is to pair the two modules. To do this, I first have to select the outputs I want to pair to the inputs. To do this, I press the pair button at the top of the receiver module, which is here. On a repeat press, the red LED will illuminate against each output to show the output that will be paired. You have to pair the modules within a few seconds or it will drop out of pairing mode, as shown by the return to the alternating LED flashes seen here. I'm going to select output one and now I'm ready to pair with my transmitter. So on my transmitter, I will operate the input I wish to pair, in this case, input one. And now the two are paired together. So as we can see, when I activate the input, the output follows. You can tell this by the illuminated green LED, which shows the status of the input on my transmitter and the output on my receiver. When I activate the switch, the green LED illuminates, showing the input is activated. On the receiver, the green LED on my output is also illuminated, showing the receiver is also activated. This means I've successfully paired the two modules together. To watch more videos of our Pro Industrial series, Click on the video playlist below, or alternatively, subscribe to the RF Solutions YouTube channel.